Berry. Um, <clears throat> thank you very much. Um, this is a motion about um, estate regeneration, asking uh, the mayor uh, to recommend in his final guide uh, to uh, good practice guide for estate regeneration that there should be uh, ballots for residents on estates uh, where major changes are being made. Uh, it's, it's a good motion, I hope we'll all agree on. Um, it's not my ideal wording, I've worked it out with uh, Tom from the Labour Party, um, and I think it's something we can all vote for here. Um, I had huge concern when the Mayor first published, published his draft Good Practice Guide to Estate Regeneration. Uh, these are the processes that councils and housing associations will need to follow when they're making major changes to estates. Um, I, I was really concerned that these were not strong enough guidelines. Um, I drew him a diagram um, and I wanted a strong guarantee that there would be no uh, GLA funding for any schemes where they hadn't had a ballot and got the permission of the residents. Uh, the motion asks for a ballot to be recommended and also, I think, which is a good thing I didn't ask for before, um, to guarantee a ballot if uh, a number, a certain number of residents in a petition request it and I think that would be a really good safeguard uh, to have as well. The reason this is important is just too many residents across London are being ignored when uh, their uh, estates are up for major changes. Often councils want to cram more homes in. This is a good thing, but councils need to work with residents in order to put homes where they fit in best on the estates, to extend homes, to put new wings, new floors onto buildings, to look at all the options that residents themselves might be putting forwards um, and not simply deciding on demolition and then holding a consultation that, that, that is aimed just at reaching that one conclusion. Um, this isn't good. Um, I've called for ballots for quite some time and I've heard from some councils how good their processes are, how well they engage with residents, how co-produce the solutions that they come forwards with for their estates are. And I think councils who have done all of that, they have nothing to fear from a ballot. It's the councils who don't do it that I think need this guarantee at the end. And it's not about only having a ballot and not doing these other things. The, the important point is having a ballot at the end of the process guarantees that the other parts of the consultation are done in good faith because they know that residents will have a final say. Um, the Mayor's manifesto uh, commitment said uh, he will require that estate regeneration only takes place where there is resident support based on full and transparent consultation. Many of us took that to mean that residents would have a final say and our motion asked the Mayor to stick by that commitment. Use our ability to vote today, uh, support the motion and help residents all over London to have that final say about what happens to their homes. I hope you'll vote for the motion today. <laughs>